we'll see where everything does go from here leading into the Extreme Rules pay-per-view on July 19th. That is a little over a month away, so we still have plenty of time to go. But before we get into Raw, before any of that, we do have a new story that we have to talk about really quick that we have up on uh, pwunlimited.co. I also put the link in the description below. Not in the description below, but in the live chat. I will put it in the description as well. And let me pull it up here as well. First reported by Pro Wrestling Sheet, one WWE developmental talent has tested positive for COVID-19, and WWE has confirmed the news, well, with a statement. So this is not the first time that somebody in WWE has tested positive for coronavirus or COVID-19. An on-screen WWE talent reportedly tested positive back in April, but it was said that they didn't come in contact with anybody at any of the tapings, so everyone was fine and they didn't take any extra precautions. Well, this evening, first reported by Pro Wrestling Sheet, they reported, Ryan Satin that is, that a WWE developmental talent who was being used as a member of the crowd has tested positive. Everyone who was at the tapings on the same day as this person will now be tested for the virus. WWE's associate medical director, Dr. Jeremy, Dr. Jeffrey Dugas, sorry, released the following statement on the matter, and I quote, A developmental talent who was last on site at WWE's training facility on Tuesday, June 9th, has tested positive for COVID-19. Since that time, no other individuals that attended the facility have reported symptoms. However, out of an abundance of caution to ensure the health and safety of the company's performers and staff, all will be tested for COVID-19 immediately. Following the test results, WWE plans to proceed with its normal television production schedule. Now again, Pro Wrestling Sheet tested this right as Raw was, or not tested, but posted this right as Raw was going off the air. So we really don't know when immediately is. Is immediately tonight? Is immediately tomorrow morning? Or was immediately earlier today? That is something we don't know. And hopefully nobody else does have positive for the virus and everything can go on as according to plan going forward. We do know that today they were supposed to be taping one episode of Raw, one episode of SmackDown, and then tomorrow, next week's episode of Raw, and next week's episode of SmackDown. So again, if we do hear anything further on this developmental talent who was at the facility, the PC, on June 9th, and if we hear anything else on this, we will keep you updated right here on the PW Unlimited YouTube channel or on pwunlimited.co. 